Qualifying would take place under sunny skies in Sochi, with the temperature well into the 30s, but the humidity also high. Returning to the championship, Ildar Rakhmatulin would participate in TCR Russia as well as the International Series with West Coast Racing. The aim of Q1, not to be in the bottom three positions, to allow yourself a chance to fight for pole in Q2. Workers continued on the Alfa Romeo Giulietta and Peter Fullin benefited from a slipstream from his teammate Ciruti to clinch a top five spot. Fabulous progress. Dusan Borkovic struggled with 30 kilos of success ballast and found the edge of adhesion on more than one occasion. Mikhail Grashov had his first time disallowed for breaching track limits, so had to go again late in the session. This time, though, would be good enough for qualification. Someone with less progression, Mikhail Ciruti, couldn't find the pace of her teammate in the Alfa Romeo and would qualify last. She was understandably frustrated. I was just trying to improve, but probably I didn't find the right setup for qualifying again. So I'm starting from the back. Now I'm getting a bit used to it, honestly, which I'm not happy with. But I will try to do something better in the race. That's the only thing I can do. Q2 would decide the sharp end of the grid, with locusts all over the track, causing a headache for the radiator temperatures. James Nash would set the benchmark time, but the British driver wasn't fully up to speed on his first attack. Behind him, though, Stefano Camini was in the Leopard Volkswagen, a second faster and provisional pole position with a 2.21.4. Russian Sergei Afanasiev would take P10 and provisional pole for race two. The championship leader, Pepe Oriola, had his first lap time disallowed, so had to go again. By doing so, he would bump his teammate outside the top 10, but the Spaniard was not concerned by that. He wanted pole. Eventually, he missed out by a tenth and a half. Attila Tassi would claim race two pole with Stefano Camini on pole for Volkswagen, their first legitimate pole position in the series. His teammate would be right behind him in third position, Morbidelli first Honda in fourth, and then the alpha of Peter Fullin, a wonderful P5. I tried to push uh, all the time and uh, to, pre to try to preserve the tyres uh, for, uh, for the race. But the car was co consistent and uh, really fast, really fast. For, for, for the first time uh, this year, uh, the car was really very fast on the, on the drive. 